Welcome back, this is Yama Jack, and today we've got uh, Desolation Gunslinger Suicidal. I want that dress, man. I want that dress. I want a dress. I don't look good in dresses because I'm fat and I'm hairy. <laughs> one day, one day. Shaving is hard. You ever shaved your legs? Okay. It's not fun. <laughs> it's not fun. It's super not fun. There's a reason why you get like epilators and wax and stuff. Super duper not fun. Square pants. <laughs> You know what's even worse than shaving your legs? Shaving your arms. Suits and boots, guys. We got something. You're thinking, I can reach everywhere on my arms. That doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, I can reach everywhere on my legs, too. It still sucks. But you know what uh, really sucks about shaving your arms? My, I'm, I'm right-handed, right? Shave my left arm? Fine. I mean, mostly. It's still a pain in the butt. Cause you're, like, stretching your arm in all kinds of weird ways. And, like, your body contorted to, to, like, see what's on the back of your arm and stuff. And it's, like... Oh, it's just a pain in the butt. And then you get to do it all with your left hand, which you're not, your non dominant hand, and uh, it super, super sucks. But anyway, that's that's why I don't have that dress. It's not because I can't find it. I could totally find that dress, make that dress. You know what I want to do? I want to make dresses. I want to make, like, clothes and stuff. That sounds like fun, doesn't it? It's getting to being like, uh, I don't know what it's called, sewing? Seamstressing? <laughs> I don't know. Um,. But to make clothes, to make your own clothes and stuff. I mean, it doesn't seem that hard. You get a bunch of fabric, you sew it together. Put on some, you know, like, uh... Here, we'll, we'll take a quick peek, okay? Get 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 over here, please. Bring up the trading controls and upgrade your gear. Okay, I'll put on a couple of weird things on it. I don't know how you get those frills at the bottom. You probably, like, get a whole bunch of stuff and then, like, pick, take it together tighter at the top. And then, uh, kind of, like, frills out at the bottom there. But, um... You know, doesn't seem that hard. It <laughs> doesn't seem that bad to make. Could I make it as a total beginner? I don't know, maybe. Maybe. Would it would it fit me well? Absolutely not. See, that's that's where you start to get into. You need the you need the proper skill set to do it. I don't. Yeah, I, I guess that doesn't seem that hard either. But like, I'd probably it would, it would probably not fit properly. I'm um, like, yeah, I might be able to like measure my waist and stuff. I wouldn't measure it right. I wouldn't know like. How much leeway I have to give myself, I wouldn't know. Like, um, you know, as I, as I, you know, for for that like frilly bit at the bottom, like how much extra stuff do I need to like get? So you probably have to like take like a, a big old bolt of cloth, stretch it around, and then like tighten up the top bit, and then cut off the excess, sew it together. You know, it's probably how it works. I'm imagining, and then that, that kind of just naturally frills out the bottom, as it uh, as it has all that extra stuff, but it's kind of being like constricted by the uh, by the by the, the the sewed bit at the top. Sounds logical to me. I've never looked into sewing, by the way, so I don't know if I'm right or wrong or God, what the heck is happening here? You all need to die. I have no idea. So. Uh... Okay, like, yeah, just just kill me, okay? Just kill me, why don't you? <laughs> we're gonna live. We're gonna live. No, we're not. <laughs> yeah, I could, I could do that. I want to get into it, because it seems like fun. And then you get to try, like, you know, if you, like, you want to try out a dress? Make a dress. You want to try out some, like, uh, weird shirt thing that you saw? Just make it, dude. <laughs> it seems like fun. Be a good hobby to have. I might get into it. I don't know. I think once I'm uh, done with my my journey of weight loss, I think I might. I think I might. You know, I might. I think that the first dress I ever wear going out will be this one. Now, getting this exact fabric and stuff, and then getting the designs on it and stuff, would probably be pretty hard. But I think it looks nice, right? It's like edgy. It's it's edgy for sure. It's goth, you know. That's, uh, you know, growing up, I never got to have my goth girl phase, because I never got to have my girl phase. It's, uh, it's time. <laughs> it's time for, it's time for goth girl. It's time for goth yamma. <laughs> Next year. Once I'm happy with myself. 
Waylos is coming along well this week again. Last week I completely just ditched it. This week I have not. Last week was a bad week. This week was not. I mean, it's just uh, more good weeks. <laughs> I think the uh, I've said it before, but the the the, the key to success is uh, tiny steps. The key to success is you and me working together. Uh, this, but unironically. Having, uh, having people to support you along your way is, is of course, an important uh, part of, uh, of, of succeeding in any respect. If you don't have anybody to support you on the... You know, whenever you're trying to do something, you're always going to fail a lot. You don't get to succeed without failure. Which is why I'm a very successful person. Oh, you little! You little! How could he do that to me? How could he do this to me? Where are you? Um, but you know you don't get to you don't get to succeed without failing a bunch. So uh, the important thing is to make sure that uh, you know you end up better than you were when you started. Yeah, I learned it from a. Uh, it was a a life lesson I learned from a um, a knife sharpening video. You know, he said. Uh, it's not about getting it perfect. It's about getting it better than it was, and I think that's uh, I think that's 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 a good thing to to kind of go by in all respects. You don't have to do perfect. My voice is already going, and it's like the start of the day. It's brutal, man. You know, you don't have to get it perfect. You just have to get it better than it was. As long as it's sharper than you left it, that's uh. You did a good job of sharpening it, and uh, I think that's true in in, um, in many respects. As you uh, as you stumble your way through life, as long as you're leaving stuff better than the way you found it, you're doing good. And uh, you know, it's not just knife sharpening; it's YouTube. You know, every every week I uh, I strive to to make the content better than it was the week before. I fail often, but I uh, I try to make it better. I think this week I've succeeded. <laughs> over over last week, for sure. Um, and, uh, you know, I try to, to continue to, to improve things to at least a certain degree and uh, make make improvements and leave, leave things better than they were, you know? That's, uh, that's what's most important to me. But, uh, yeah, the, um, the, the dress thing is probably going to happen. That's probably going to be the first dress that I, I ever wear. You know? I might even, uh, like, start working on it now. At the size that I want to be. The, the issue with that is it's really easy to not know what size I'm going to be and then make it wrong. Like, you know, hey, how big are my boobs going to be when I've lost weight? A, I'm going to lose some boob size because I lose weight. B, I'm still going through, like, my voice is just terrible right now. Oh, my God. B, I'm still going through like puberty kind of right now with the hormones. Um, like, oh my god, my voice is terrible. What the heck? <laughs> I'm not sick. I just talk a lot. Oh my god. Today's gonna be brutal. Today is gonna be brutal. Yep, um, it's just gonna be a lot of uh, clear my throat throughout the day, I guess. It's, uh, it's one of those days. Just one of those days. I'm uh, I'm also being like terrible in the game right now. If you haven't noticed, yeah, you shoot, dude. Let's see if I care about you shooting, buddy. I've been recording for almost an hour and a half today, but like that's that's not that much in the grand scheme of things, you know. An hour and a half of talking, I I, I that's like half of a stream. It's not even like a quarter of what I do in a day. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be giving me that much grief. It's usually towards the end of the day, but and it's like the start of the week too. Like I don't know what's going on, man. My voice is uh, maybe I am sick. <laughs> the sudden realization, as she realizes that perhaps she's not as healthy as she once thought she was. Maybe I have COVID. Okay. This this is happening, is it? Is this is this what we're? If this is this what I've become now? You're not, you're not, you're not doing that to me, okay? You're not doing that to me. Bring it up here, buddy. Bring it up here. Oh, 
Jab. 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 Come on, man. I think I think he's going for the for the big explosion now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that always feels good when you take out the husk with the knife. What a brutal round, man. I was having to clear my throat a billion times and it really cost me. It really cost me, man. Shame they couldn't make it look good. What well, shame. You ever try to do voices? I don't know if you've noticed, but I do on occasion. Only on occasion, not all too often. <laughs> I do voices all the time, dude. I'm a freak. I'm a freak that likes to talk a lot. Yeah, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> um, I do talk a lot. All these, all these voices, I'm not coming up with them on the fly. I talk to myself all the time, and I come up with voices that I like, and the, you know, think about situations and where they can be used and stuff, and I think that I uh, do a good job of uh, making myself look the fool. Don't I? I think so. I really don't want to be over here. I really want to be over there. Where you guys are is where I want to be right now, okay? Yeah, it sounds fun. Making dresses and shirts and stuff. It sounds fun. Yeah, you just go buy, like, a bunch of fabric. I mean, how, how expensive can fabric be, right? Probably not that expensive. Like, relative to, like, buying a nice shirt. Like, buying a nice fabric? It's, it's got to be cheaper, right? There's no way that they're making, like, nice, good quality shirts out of fabric. And then, like, somehow making it cheaper than the raw fabric. I mean, they obviously get, like, deals when you're buying in bulk and stuff, but, like... Surely, surely, like a, a nice, you can make like a couple of shirts, like a couple of nice shirts for for like way less than uh, than what you pay for the uh, uh, shirt, like the the the, the what, you, what you would pay for a couple of nice shirts, you know? Surely, I'm 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 confident. Any of you guys do uh, any kind of work with that kind of stuff? You make clothes and stuff, whatever it's called. Then uh, yeah, let me know in the comments uh, how much how much you guys spend on like uh, how much does a shirt cost to make? I don't know because you got like there 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 are things that you have to buy for for making a shirt. Like to make a shirt, you gotta have uh, uh, you gotta have fabric for one, um, and then you have to have um, like some some things are gonna be like hard if you want to get like a, a woven thing, you know, like a silken shirt or something like that. Like that's gonna cost. A lot more to make, obviously, and it's going to take a lot more time rather than just like stitching together different pieces of fabric. Um, but I don't know how, how much does like a shirt cost if you if you make if you made a shirt, how much does a shirt cost? You know, not including like I don't know the the cost of like printing something on it if you want something printed on it. Um. Like just just the raw fabric, like and 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 a half decent shirt that that you would wear outside. <laughs> how much how much does that cost to make? Can't be more than like a couple of bucks, right? For just a basic plain colored shirt. You know, it take you time, definitely, right? Like as an experienced person in making shirts, like a basic single color shirt, probably gonna take you like I don't know, ten to thirty minutes, probably. Like if you're making them for yourself, you already know like what size you have to make it and all that. And you just have to you have like the fabric in front of you. You just have to stitch it all together, cut it up. I'm guessing you could probably do that in like 30 minutes, just for like a single plain color shirt, right? I'm, I'm guessing it shouldn't take that long. Maybe I'm wrong. I could be wrong. I mean, you know, make a fool out of me. Go for it <laughs> by all means. But uh, I'm, I'm I'm thinking about it. I'm like I don't know. You get like the back fabric. You get the front fabric. <laughs> you get the the like um, arm fabrics. You sew them all together. Now you have a now you have a shirt. You know, put on a the hem or whatever it's called. Cover up the edges and keep them from fraying. You, know, you can, like fold it up or whatever, and then stitch it uh stitch it up a little bit just to, to keep the, the the very edges of the fabric from from being uh touchable and, and, and fraying and stuff it uh you know get the collar on it or whatever if you, if you have one of those but again it's pretty much the same thing just kind of fold it over 
So what up? I really hate being over here. I don't know why I always come over here. I don't know. As, a, as an experienced person in doing it, I think you could do a shirt in about a half an hour. Probably. Ten minutes is, is my, like, I think that's a little bit crazy, but maybe that's possible if you're, like, really good at it. But a half an hour for, like, the average person who's been doing this for a while to make a shirt for themselves. They're like, oh, shoot, I've accidentally burned all of my shirts. I only have pink fabric and some thread and a needle. Uh, I need to make a, a shirt really, really quickly so I can leave the house because right now I'm shirtless. 30 minutes, I think you can get a shirt. <laughs> I think so. I think so. I believe. Um, maybe I'm wrong. Again, prove me wrong. I'd, I'd, I'd love to be proven wrong. But, uh, I'd love to, I'd love to try it out as well. And then obviously, like, you know, if you want to have, like, I've got, like, this weird, it's not really, I, mean, I guess it's kind of just fabric, but it's really, like, soft fabric. Probably takes more time to do that. I've got, like, buttons on it, and then there's, like, this, this red, like, hem on it. And it, like, it's got all this open stuff, and then the, the edges are, like, folded over by, like, the smallest amount, and then, like, stitched up and stuff, and it's, like... I'm looking at this shirt that I'm wearing right now, and I'm like, yes, there's a lot of work involved in this shirt that I am wearing. But this shirt isn't one that I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm not talking about making this one with a whole bunch of birds and stuff all over it. No, sir. Or ma'am, to the one ma'am out there. I don't know. Sounds fun, though. Sounds fun. I'd love to get into to making shirts and stuff. And that dress that I've got wearing on this character, I want it. I might make it. I might do a cosplay of my character. I've already got the hair. <laughs> the hair I, the hair is, like, pretty much exactly what I have. Just pink. And uh, sometimes my hair is also pink, so, I mean... <laughs> the, the, the hair I've got. <laughs> that, 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 that's, that's doable. Um, it's it's the, um, the, the, the rest of it that's... Uh, not super, super, super accurate yet. <laughs> but I'd love to do a cosplay of my character one day. That sounds like it'd be fun, you know? Doesn't it? Sounds like it'd be fun. I mean, to, like, make that. To be like, my first cosplay to be, like, a character that I've kind of made myself. I don't know. That's not... Where, where on earth has he gone? What on earth is happening here? I hate when he just gets lost somewhere because I have like a whole bunch of these poops to deal with and it's so frustrating because I'm like, you could have just been good to me and showed up and, and not wasted my time with a billion poops. Instead, you just went for a lap around, you know, Hungary, 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 and uh, wasted everybody's time. You know how long it takes to do a lap around Hungary? Takes a long time. I wouldn't know. Never done it. There's some country. I forget what the name of it is, but it's got like a really small island. Money, anyone? As as in that is the country. <laughs> not not that because like a lot of countries have really small islands. You know, like people people live on them. Um, I live on an island. Um, not a very small one though. It's kind of small, but it's kind of big too. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I'll see you next time. Tell me about dresses. If you make clothes, then like, please tell me. I'd love to learn. <laughs> see ya. Bye-bye.